जय श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु नित्यानंद श्री अद्विदाधर श्रीवासदि गौर भक्तवृंद हरे कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा 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 हरे 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 रामा हरे रामा राम रामा हरे हे ग्रेस्ट रवि प्रभु की सो मच हैव बीन टॉक बाय दिनबंधु प्रभु प्रेमनाथ जी अन हरिदास प्रभु सम ऑफ माई रिमेम्बरेंस सुरा प्रभु फर्स्ट टाइम आई मेट हिम इन नाइनटीन सेवेंटी सेवन ही वॉज प्रभुपाद डोर कीपर इफ यू गो टू परिक्रमा मार्ग ऑफ वृंदावन फिर किचन इज देयर ऑन द टॉप डाउन दे यू टू बी डोर विच गो टू प्रभुपाद क्वार्टर प्रभुपाद क्वार्टर एंड आई वॉज सेवेंटीन ईयर ओल्ड बॉय आई वॉन्टेड टू गो टू सी प्रभुपाद The Prabhupada usually used to come out evening time in in uh, in quarter and sit on that place and they used to chant Jai Radha Madhav. Prabhupada gave lecture and devotees were surrounded, but only very few devotees were allowed to come inside. Not everybody. And I used to try to sneak, try to run from that side. And once Sarabhi Prabhu stopped me. He was sannyasi those days. So he stopped me. Lean, thin, tall. He stopped me. I mean, although he's very humble, but he was very tough also. Second time, again I tried other day, and he hold me and he pushed me. Those day fighting was very easy. Now we don't fight much. Our Dada Hari Das is here. Eh? कितने लोगों को मारा होगा अब तक से? हरिदास तुम मरेगा तो मैं बताऊंगा क्या 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 है पूरा आई विल टेल एवरी थिंग अबाउट हिम ही भागवतम क्लास यू विल स्टार्ट फ्रॉम डॉग और क्या क्या गाली देते हुए बात करूँ सो एनी वे सो डिबोडी वे आर वेरी टफ एंड दे आर वेरी डेडिकेटेड टू सिला प्रभुपाद सुरभ प्रभु सुरभ महाराज डेडिकेशन वॉज यू नो वेरी स्ट्रॉन्ग टू प्रोटेक्ट शिल प्रभुपाद हिज मिशन एंड यू नो हिज ऑर्डर That was my first session in '77. Then when I came here, those day the project office was Sankirtan office. If building, Mr. Prabhu, if building, so half part was Sankirtan office. Among Lila Prabhu, he was the Sankirtan leader at the Mahindra Meter door, and other side was project office. I used to go there. As Haridas Prabhu said, you know, I had a good friend, Eknath Prabhu, and I just used to go and meet him there. So they had table around, and Sura Prabhu used to stand there, and they used to be there watching, doing something. Though the temple was not complete, all the temple was open, but whole pujari area of the first floor was not complete, like no. Jali were not made there, and all those things. And so I was on the top floor. The no jali and all those things were there. So I think I don't know what they were doing, but they were doing something. Then after some time, they wanted to vacate that office to make it library party. So that time they wanted to move the office. I don't remember the year. In uh, first floor. By that time, Murthy Das had joined Surab. Murti Das was all part of the, and then uh, our temple commander. Then I help move the things from there in room number one 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 next to Kapila Prabhu office. Other memory I have is Sura Prabhu that he was very quiet, not too much mixing with or talking too much. Very quiet. He used to come Mangala Arti and stand where we have sound system right now in that corner. He used to stand there quietly for Mangala Arti. He was not much of Kirtan leader or anything, but he gave classes. Once I remember in uh, A, B, C, I think Brahmacharya is some D building, no? Yes, yeah, so D building. There are four rooms. 
and one room was Giriraj Swami Sridhar Maharaj. Other room, later on I took that room. The corner room was Surap Maharaj and Jagat Guru Maharaj. And big room was our Dada Haridas and few others. And next room was Nestor Gonaya and others. So anyway, so one day, Bhagavatam class, I asked some householder to give class. And I was going, so my habit, even today sometime, I get in mood to visit Brahmachari Ashram. But those days, I used to go Brahmachari Ashram quite often. After Mangala Arati, before Guru Puja, and before class, before Sandhya Arati. So the good exercise, Brahmachari Ashram is not too big, just like two floor. So Gira Swami caught me outside the building. And him and Surab, they are walking together. So he asked me, who is giving class today? So I told that devotee's name. I, I don't remember who was. Then he said, why you didn't ask Surabhi Maharaj to give a class? I said, he just gave few days back. He said, so what? He said, when sannyasis are here, you must, uh, you must give preference to sannyasis to give classes. That's what Giraj Swami told me. Giraj Prabhu told me those days. Surabha was always sannyasi. So when sannyasis are here, first give preference to sannyasi. So thereafter, I met Surabh Prabhu. That by that time, he was not sannyasi. He was staying in Delhi in Punjabi Bagh. He started a small temple. Today we have a Punjabi Bagh temple that was started by Surabh Prabhu. And uh, I had gone to Delhi. We had temple in Greater Kailas, M block. And that time only he had started. Then I wanted to meet him because he had left you know, for some time, then again he came and he started. So I wanted to meet him. I went to meet him. And he was, I, I, as usual, he's very loving, very affectionate. And uh, he was saying what he wanted to do there. In garage, they had a beautiful deity of Radha Raman or Radhika Raman, whatever, in garage. And the building was there. And of course, Panjabi Bhak Temple is big temple now. They moved from that location to a new location, but yes, he started. The last I met Sura Prabhu two months back in Los Angeles on 29th, 30th May. And we had Prabhupada reunion in Los Angeles. So many devotees came. Rameshwar Prabhu was there, Bhagavan, Surab, and many others. So once again we met, he, looks, he looked exactly the same that I had seen him last, beside his French beard. Otherwise everything, as it is, not much change. And he was with, I guess, wife, you know, eh? soulmate, okay, whatever. The Filipino wife he had. And then, yes, we talked about Hare Krishna land. I invited him to come here to see Raharas Bihari and second phase heaven on the earth. I showed Kanpur temple and I didn't even tell who is architect. He told, is it Premnath who designed this? I said, yes. That was his word. So I said, why didn't you come to Juhu? He said, yes, I want to come. But I, doctor, I given only two months time to me. So I'm going to uh, Philippines, and from there, I'll come to Vrindavan. So, after two days, he left. But in his talk, he talked about how he joined his Khan. So, Din Bandhu Prabhu briefly said, but he said a little different, uh, that, you know, about his initiation. Prabhupada announced, tomorrow there will be initiation. And it was mystery. Everybody is looking, who is going to take initiation? Is there anybody who is going to take initiation? Nobody knew. And he told Tamal Krishna Maharaj to arrange. Everything was arranged. And then, 
Only that day, Prabhupada announced, you know, his name, whatever his name was, that he will be initiated. And then he was initiated that day. I think first and second, both initiation, he also got like Bhakti Maharaj. So he had a lot of blessing from Srila Prabhupada. And uh, yeah, he, he also said that how Prabhupada personally taught him about everything. He told that what kind of building Prabhupada wanted, they designed different kind of building. And Prabhupada didn't like. Premnaji did not elaborate enough, but I'm sure many things we forget, but he was elaborately, you know, saying that they, I think they had designed 12 story building or something, and then aviation problem was there, then Prabhupada said, tear it down, and all those things sort of, you know. And Surabh said that even Hyderabad or Vrindavan temple, when I designed very nicely, Prabhupada said few things, that's it. But for Bombay temple, Prabhupada was very meticulous for each and everything. How the guest house should look like, how the temple should look like. So all the detail, Surabh Prabhupada saying. I mean, yeah, so these devotees are not ordinary devotees who have served Srila Prabhupada in the beginning. And Prabhupada has not left them. Prabhupada is always keeping them with him. Therefore, they keep coming. Even they go, but they come back. Like they are saying in Hindi, Jaise udi jahaj ki pakchi, Phir jahaj par aaye, Miraman anat kaha sukh paaye. If there is only water in the ocean, and there is a bird on the ship, even she fly, where will she go? She will again come back on the ship. Same way devotee of Iskan who had taken halwa puri a lot those days. Those days prasadam was special, nowadays different. And philosophy of Krishna consciousness movement. Even they go, they will not go too far. They will come back. We have seen many devotees, they went but they came back. So Sura Prabhu is one of them. And towards the end his consciousness was very nice. He remembered Prabhupada and you know, Lord Chaitanya. A very dear and loving devotee, very quiet, humble, sage, and a lot to learn from His Grace Sri Prabhu. Sri Prabhu ki jai.